sustainability. Sustainability means conserving our natural resources and saving our environment before we reach the tipping point. Recycling. Recycling provides a way for us to convert waste materials into new products. Contamination. When non-recyclable items are mixed in with recyclables, it can cause the entire batch of recycling to be discarded and sent to a landfill. An estimated 25% of all waste thrown into recycling around the world is contaminated and has nowhere to go. Contamination is also a big problem at our residential school, the North Carolina School of Science and Math in Durham, North Carolina, where we recycle 23.66 tons annually. We've had to take away recycling for periods of time because our percentage of contamination was so high. To date, we have upgraded our recycling bins and distributed posters across campus describing the sources of contamination and the importance of recycling. But we knew we could do more to educate our community on how to discriminate between recycling and contamination at the collection site. Sustainability-focused students partnered with the students in the Artificial Intelligence program to develop an app that identifies whether an object is recycling or trash. The project is called Sustainable Recycling Project. When developing an AI or machine learning algorithm, one of the most important parts is compiling the image database that can be used to train the algorithm to identify the defining characteristics of an object. We first used a pre-established image database of trash called the TACO database. We also photograph images of common sources of recyclables and contamination from around our school and label them to make our own image database to help train our algorithm. The AI program ran through each category of image and began to learn what properties such as reflectivity, color, texture, and malleability characterize each specific type of object. Once enough images were used to train the AI neural network, we were able to test the algorithm and implement it in an app with a live feed that was able to discriminate between single objects with a 70% or greater accuracy. We were also able to implement a prototype version of the app on the Android 9 device that could discriminate between multiple objects in a live feed with greater than 50% accuracy. One benefit to creating an app as opposed to a handheld device or just a sorting bin is our app will be accessible for download on any phone platform. This means that people across the world are able to have an entire database for recycling identification information at their fingertips. We are going to continue to work on our project throughout the school year and summer to build up our image database, increase the accuracy of our algorithm, and work out the bugs in our app. We hope to implement our technology at recycling bins on campus to reduce contamination to less than 5%. We hope that by harnessing the power of AI to educate about recycling, we can make a difference for tomorrow's generation, one person at a time.